Michelangelo di Lodovico Buonarroti Simoni, born March 1475 to February 18, 1564, was an Italian sculptor, painter, architect, poet, and engineer of the High Renaissance who exerted an unparalleled influence on the development of Western art. Considered to be the greatest living artist during his lifetime, he has also since been described as one of the greatest artists of all time. A number of Michelangelo's works in painting, sculpture, and architecture rank among the most famous in existence. Michael also, Michelangelo also created two of the most influential frescoes in the history of Western art, the scenes from Genesis on the ceiling of the Sistine Chapel in Rome and the Last Judgment on its altar wall. The creation of Adam differs from typical creation scenes painted up until that time. Here two figures dominate the scene, God on the right and Adam on the left. The form is supported by on, on angels who fly without wings, but tho who, those who fly is made clear by the japery which whips out from underneath them. God is depicted as an elderly yet muscular man with gray hair and long beard which react toward the movement of the flight. This is a far cry from the imperial images of God that had otherwise been created in the West dating back to the time of late antiquity. Rather than wearing royal garments and depicted as an all-powerful ruler, he wears only a light tunic which leaves much of his arms and legs exposed. One might say that this is much a more intimate portrait of God because he is shown in a state that is not untouchable and remote from men, but one which is accessible to him. In all, the painting shows several hallmarks of Michelangelo's painting style, the lounging position of both Adam and God, the ease of bodies which are both muscular and twisting, and the painting of figures who come across his work of sculpture. It is good to remember that Michelangelo was, after all, a sculptor. Painting was not his primary area. The creation of Adam was completed over the course of two years, from 1511 to 1512. However, with it being part of the full ceiling, the full ceiling took from 1508 through 1512, an extra three years. The historical relevance to this time would be that it was during the Renaissance, and it happened to be in Italy, which is widely considered the heart of the Renaissance. Another important factor to this time was that it was during Pope Julius II who had commissioned this art to be done by Michelangelo. Material and Medium The mediums utilized by Michelangelo on the ceiling were gold and fresco. Fresco was a combination of a damp plaster mixed with pigments that he was able to paint with while sort of molding this plaster onto the Sistine Chapel. The dimensions of the creation of Adam are 15 feet 9 inches by 7 feet 7 inches. The painting is the same size as all the other paintings in the, on the ceiling of the Sixteen Chapel and in the painting you can see that the subjects God and Adam are slightly larger than an average person and you can see that God is much larger than all the angels carrying him. The location of this work is is at the Sixteen Chapel in the Vatican in Rome, Italy. It has remained there since the work has been since the work was completed. Uh the original purpose of this painting was to depict God's creation of Adam from the book of Genesis in the Bible. The audience the first audience of this piece were religious people who went to the Sistine Chapel. The location was originally used for religious ceremonies by the Pope and is now is used is still used for religious purposes but is also used as a museum to depict all the art and the pieces. At the time the painting has had high praise for its religious uses and is now considered one of the greatest pieces in the, of the Italian Renaissance 
for its artistic reasons.